I am Kent Blankenship, drummer of Solicide. And I'm Rich Yes, uh, singer of Solicide. We're here today to speak of the toy run, uh, the cause that we raise money each year for the Joe DiMaggio Children's Hospital. It, whatever we raise goes to the hospital, the hospital gives it to the kids, whether it be by toys or helps for research, or maybe um, they need a DVD player for the room or Xbox. Money all goes to the kids in that matter, so they feel a little more comfortable at the hospital where they have their stay there. During the Christmas holidays, it's the best time to give when you can. We try throughout the year, we put it, we put a, we pass a jar around all our shows, we collect for the whole year, and at the end of the year we donate a check to the Judge Magic Shows at the hospital on behalf of Solicide also. We any tips we, we make, we don't keep, they go into the jar. You know, we can't do it alone, you know, without us. And without you guys, there's nobody. It takes a whole team, you know. So the fans that come out to appreciate the music give back that dollar. So it's really their check we're presenting for them at the same time. This year we raised... Well, we, we had a short year this year because we had only probably six or seven shows. For the raffle tickets, we raised $760, and the rest was donated to the jar. So we got up to $1,141.75. <laughs> Good morning, I'm meteorologist Julie Durda from WSBN. We're here at Joe DiMaggio's Children's Hospital. We have been able to raise so much money for the Toys in the Sun Run. The community has really come together and we're going to have so much fun just making sure that we touch all of these kids' hearts. And there's so many children here that are in need and we're lucky to be a part of helping them. And right now we're going to go on a tour. I've never done this before, so this will be nice and amazing for me to meet the actual kids that are being helped. Oh, you know what he wants for Christmas? A microphone. You want a microphone for Christmas? Well, if, you know, maybe just Concert's getting go like this. Just sing it. I, I, I can make believe it's a microphone. And here you go. Get the looks on TV. Uh, <laughs> okay, so. Chrissy, help us. Come in. No, helping us today. On uh, lead vocals is my great friend, uh, songwriter, producer, George Noriega. George has done a lot of stuff with Shakira and Jennifer Lopez. She's a dad. She knows what this is about. My little girl wishes she could be here. She'll come next And uh, my name is Richie Supa, and I am a songwriter. I write for Pink and Bon Jovi and Aerosmith, and uh, I'm so old that. Uh, <laughs> um, and we do this every year. Dave, Dave Amtrick, you know, we swings of gold, and we set this up way back when his dad was alive. You know, we love him. And, and uh, so we just carry on the tradition.
Child Life Specialist here at Joe DiMaggio. Child Life is here to help make the hospital experience a little better for the kids. We teach about what's going on, we provide a lot of activities, um, playroom, we have a family center, um, we do free lunch for parents every day, we have a Conine Clubhouse across the street where the families can actually stay for free. So it's really great to have the Toys in the Sun run to help supplement things that we can do here. And we're building a new hospital across the street, which will be open next year when you guys come. Um, but it's really great to be able to just um, have these things to do for the kids. Having the toys in the playroom to help the kids get their mind off being here. Um, they may have never been in the hospital before, or they may have grown up in the hospital. But either way, it's going to help them just feel like a kid again. Not feel like they're stuck in this building where it's just full of you know, people who are going to be poking them all the time, it's actually going to be a fun place and it's just a place you go to get better. Um, so we really appreciate everything you guys do for us and when you bring the guys out and they sing, the kids love it. It's just so cute. So we really appreciate everything. It makes Ronnie um, stay here more easier. You know, they have a lot of games and toys and stuff like that. You know, it works, you know, sometimes when he, he be in pain and um, they'll bring him a Xbox or GameCube and he'll start planning and forget all about his pain and what he's going through. So I appreciate the hospital for having that. Seventeen years, but we're still here. I look the same age too. <laughs>